Welcome to a pack with me for my National American Mistake pageant. As you can see, we have my entire wardrobe out here in the middle of our house and we need to pack it away. Yeah, we got a lot to pack. My slippers, my gown, my faces. Where do we start? I honestly have no idea, but we are in this together. Nothing like last minute packing. Okay. I mean, I could be doing this tomorrow so like it's not that last minute at least i recommend a binder for every pageant check-in you know just makes it better i have my headshot right here shout out to my teammate aiden for taking it what a slay photo inside we have my paperwork and we have the updated teen schedule because i am still a teen at 19. okay so we will just go in chronological order and hope for the best so we first have early check-in. The outfit for this is so good. I had a vision and the vision worked out in my favor. So let me get the dress. Here is the check-in dress. She is so gorgeous. She was on sale. I believe she was like 12 or $14. And she is just stunning. So we're putting her in this because obviously I'm not wearing this for the three hour car ride. I am wearing some comfy clothes. So we have this. We'll hang that up right here. We need to find the earrings and the shoes. They're just some cute pink earrings, nothing too fancy. So I'm just putting them in a little plastic bag. So now we have the earrings with the dress. We have the shoes. They are from Lulu's. These are the shoes I wore for my graduation. They're super cute. They're the pink that match the earrings pretty, pretty well actually. And they just like lace up and they're so pretty. And so I am going to put these in the garment bag and leave the box behind because the box is a little bulky. Second outfit complete. Okie dokie. Next, we have the PJ. Actually, next we have dinner with Allison. So let me get that dress. Here's my dinner with Allison dress. As we do all things when we pack, we roll. And I'm actually gonna put this in the bottom of that garment bag because I'm literally going from check-in to dinner. So I'm gonna do that. Okay, now she is complete. Actually, I don't have my shoes for that, but I could just wear the pink ones and be fine. But here is the check-in and dinner fit. Now we can go to the PJ party. The PJs for this year are super cute. Flamingos, how cute is that? So we have the matching flamingo PJ set. So it's just some shorts, little PJ top looking thing this pink undershirt and then these slippers so we'll put this together and i'm gonna work my way back actually because that is chronologically smarter i think because you like fill the suitcase up so if we're going backwards i'm actually staying the night at our hotel after our finale just because our finale is getting done at 9 45 and so that's kind of late especially for me because i'm like a grandma and i love to go to bed early so I have my fit and I need a bathing suit for Monday. So let me go grab that. Okay, we're back. We got a bathing suit and shorts. And then I have some like extra like comfy get ready outfits like going to be packed that are currently just sitting in there. And I'm probably gonna just wear one of those on our way back. But that is for the pool. From the pool, we have the finale. And for the finale, I have my jean shorts and my top, which I will do later. Before that, we have casual clothes. I'm very excited for this one. I just got this. Look how cute this little romper is. So I plan to wear this for our final rehearsal before the finale, just because it's a romper and you can't go wrong with shorts. And then my parents and I normally go to Olive Garden after. It's like a little tradition we now have. So I will be wearing that. Next we have interview outfit which is right behind me is that purple dress. And I'm just gonna put that in a garment bag and call it a day. Then we have my formal gown. I am wearing the same one from last year. So like, if you wanna check it out, you could. It's in my National American Miss vlog from last year, or you could just wait a week and you'll see it or you'll see it on Instagram. It's really cute. Was I reading this right? Yeah, okay. <laughs> Got a little nervous there. Um, then we have fun fitness. Fun fitness outfit this year is literally chef's kiss. It is so good. Obviously it doesn't look so cool on the hanger. It's just a white tennis skirt and a purple sports bra. And these shoes are so cute. They're white sneakers with like the purple lace that matches like perfectly. It's so cute. I'm gonna put this in the same 
um, garment bag as my interview outfit and my runway outfit, which I think is next. Just kidding, it's actress. So for actress, I just have my t-shirt and shorts. I'll just make sure my shorts are on top. But I will put this in a garment bag when I get to it. So on Saturday, I don't really have a lot of free time, but I like to just pack an extra little thing to like wear around if I'm going to like the princesses optionals or the princess formal wear or whatever it might be. So I just have this little red romper I'm packing as well. I don't think I'll be able to wear it just because I have such a tight schedule. I would just like the option to wear it if I got the chance. So then we have actress, which I just talked about. Now we have runway. Okay, again, runway outfit, not so cool on the hanger, but here she is. So it's this really cool top and then these black leather shorts. And then I'm packing this black leather, faux leather, they're both faux leather. Uh, skirt just in case something happens with the shorts but here's runway and then I also have spoke small after I'm most likely wearing that purple dress but I'm packing this blue one just in case because you can never overpack for pageants or in life and then I'm also just gonna pack this oops this really cute pink floral dress because you can never have too many casual clothes no one talks about how cold the ballrooms get and so you have to bring a jacket of some sort. I am a athletic girly and I love my athletic jacket and it's like so easy to take on and off for hair and makeup too. So I am packing that on top because that is a necessity. Next, we have casual clothes. So I may actually be able to wear that red romper if I want or the pink football dress. We'll see. The PJ party and my regular PJs. So these are gonna be my coming home clothes slash get ready clothes. So we have some Target sweatpants, a tube top for hair and makeup, this tank top, and then we have these shorts if it's a little bit warmer. They're sweatpants shorts, they're from Target, they're super cute. Can't forget the PJs, have this National American Miss shirt that I have. And then we gotta rock the Olaf sleeping pants from Walmart. Oh, next we're packing a steamer because you never know what's gonna happen. The infamous jean shorts that I wear for actress and the finale. So then lastly, we'll just pack the PJs for the PJ party. Okay, so that is officially it for this. So now it's time for shoes. Time for suitcase number two, runway shoes. Slippers on top of those because they're really like um, these are my slippers I will wear around the hotel because I have very sensitive feet apparently and I cannot wear heels for a long period of time. So those are, these are just off Amazon in case you want to match. White sneakers for actress and the finale. These are my formal wear shoes. These are some everywhere shoes. I'm thinking I'm actually going to leave these ones behind. And then we have Fun Fitness and Interview. Shoes. Okay, we have formal wear, interview, and where are the sneakers? We have the sneakers. Okay. It's like a puzzle, but there's no right answer. Okay, that works. As long as it closes. Come on, you can do it. There was definitely a way easier way to do that. But that's okay. Okay, shoes are done. This is looking good. So we have everything. Pretty much. So we have the wagon full of everything we might need. We got shoes, clothes, more clothes. All we need now is the curling iron, my toiletries, a phone charger, and myself. And we will be good to go for the National American Myth State Pageant. I'm so excited. So stay tuned for the State Pageant vlog coming to you in a week once this is posted. So stay tuned for that and I'll see you next time.